Hello everybody, my name is Edson and welcome back to a brand new Dead by Daylight challenge. This one is a bit of an interesting one. Uh, this is the All Eyes on Me challenge. Uh, we are basically using the four perks with eyes as icons. And how this works is you're the object of obsession, which is the sort of the main perk within this. Uh, which means if you're outside of the killer's terror radius... The killer and yourself can see each other, see each other's auras, as long as you're looking in the direction of the killer. So I can sort of see where the killer is. It's a lot easier to explain when in game. Um, so I can look around uh, and see the killer within 64 meters or 72 um, range. And yeah, it's it's easy to explain once you see it. It's, it's an interesting perk. I don't really like it, but for the challenge, we're using it. Then we have Kindred, Deja Vu, and Dark Sense. Dark Sense means we can see the killer's aura every time a generator is completed. When the last gen is completed, we can see the killer's aura for 10 seconds instead of 5, which you get when the generator is completed. You also have Kindred, which means it so you can see the three closest generators. Uh, no, sorry, Deja Vu. You can see the three closest generators um, every time a generator is completed or when you start the trial for 60 seconds. So basically you can see the, the generators that are closest to each other to work on them and it essentially makes it so it spreads out. I actually like this perk, I've used it a little bit in the past and it's quite good to be honest if you're, if you're playing solo and you're trying to get the, the center gens slash the gens that are super close um, done first so that later on in the game it's a lot easier to work on gens because they're a lot more spread out. And then Kindred, when you're on the hook, everyone can see you. Um, Everyone can see everyone, essentially. Everyone can see all of the auras of survivors, so you can tell if somebody's going for them. And then you can see the killer's aura if they're within 60 meters of me, so if they're face camping me. It's some interesting perks, and I'm looking forward to trying it. So let's do it! All right, we're on the Red Forest. I should also say that we are uh, using a purple flashlight because I feel like there's a killer. Is that the killer? I feel like I'm going to get chased quite a bit. It's... Pig. So I can see the pig now, but if I look away, neither of us can see each other. So basically I can keep checking where the pig is. You know? That's essentially how the perk works. So there you go. See the pig, so now I need to look this way. Knowing that she's over there. For me. If, and if I hear the heartbeat, I think I can't see her. But like now, if I look, I can't see her. So essentially, if you're getting chased and she's near, you don't. Uh, she doesn't basically have just free reign of ha of seeing you when you're running around. If you're looking at her, so I may as well keep looking around now. And if the heartbeat disappears, we can see her. Now, I wonder if this works if she crouches, you know? I never really knew that with a pig. Uh oh, uh oh. This is not going well. Oh my God.
No! I've used this perk so badly. This is so difficult. I need to actually crawl away, crawl away, crawl away, crawl away. If he's just put me in the basement then. This has just gone real bad. I should have been looking away. I should have just bailed as soon as that person got down super close. That person DC'd great. That person's down. That person's gonna die. <laughs> oh my god. Everyone's DCing. Even if she was nice and wanted to give one of us the hatch, it's impossible. Because we still need another gen. Oh my god, the challenges the last couple of days have gone real bad. I'm here, you dumb dumb. Don't tell me she's going to not find me. I've got objects of obsession as well, I need to look away. I'm not here! Do you want to give me the hatch? No, you're going to give me a hat instead. I said hatch, not hat. I'm not even going to wiggle. I'm not even going to wiggle. Thanks. Great games. GG's. Have a nice day. That was a fun game. <laughs> that was so fun. Hopefully we can try and make it work in the next one. That was just really a real unlucky uh, set of events that happened there. Okay, attempt two after two broken lobbies. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, she hasn't seen us. I'm about to see her in a second. There, there she is. Okay. So we work on this, and then we're set. Oh, that was close. Oh, it's got chased straight away. Uh, so we've had two lobbies that, well, one lobby that didn't load at all, and the other looked like it was loading uh, into the game. And we just, I don't know. Just never went in. So we have two that. Great. Great, great, great. I love Dead by Daylight. <laughs> if any of you guys haven't checked out the last challenge video, um, we check it out we did a medic challenge and it went pretty much like this we just got annihilated in both games it it did not go well and this one doesn't look like it's going too well either damn she really got max use out of that haunted ground she got two people down i should have bailed when i heard her coming Gone. That person's not going to go for me. I don't think that person's going to go for me. That person's being chased. And she's... You're self-caring. You're self-caring. And that person's working on a totem. This person's... Today, we. What is happening?
Right, seeing as in the others don't seem to be going for them that much, I'm going to go. I'm just going to try and not look that way. Oh my gosh. Just look at the wall. Dead by daylight. I give up. We've had some proper unlucky games. All right. We could we could do this. We could do this. Once those two have finished self-care with each other. And if she finds them, I think she's about to find them. No 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 no. Oh my gosh, she's about to find them. How did she not hear them? I don't, I don't think either of them are gonna... Oh no, what is? Oh crap! I didn't even mean to let go there. Oh! This has been an interesting recording session of Dead by Daylight. I recorded the last challenge and this challenge and all four games have gone like this. It's been interesting. Hopefully, the next challenge I'm about to record goes better. It probably won't though. <laughs> oh, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, I'll speak to you all soon. Take care.